So Casey, can you tell us, when you have a patient in your clinic who you suspect has MDS, what do you do to go about diagnosing the disease? Well, usually when a patient presents with anemia, we'll go through and first make sure that there aren't any treatable causes of the anemia that occur outside of the bone marrow. For example, we want to rule out nutritional deficiencies like iron deficiency that's easily treated with iron replacement, B12 deficiency that we can also give B12 to correct. Um, in addition, it's important to rule out that the patient has GI bleeding or other types of bleeding that might be causing anemia. And also kidney dysfunction, which is common in older adults. This can lead to a reduction in the hormone erythropoietin that signals the bone marrow to produce more red blood cells. Once we've ruled out these treatable or reversible causes that are all external to the bone marrow, then we'll recommend a bone marrow biopsy. A bone marrow biopsy is a, an outpatient procedure where we take a small sample from the bone marrow and take a look at it under the microscope as well as sending for important genetic tests such as cytogenetics or additional molecular mutational analyses. And these can give us a lot more information about what's happening in that bone marrow.